Okay, in this video, we want to talk about flash messages or session messages and see how we can show them to the users. So for example, when I register, I am redirected to my dashboard and I want to see a message that says welcome or the user was created successfully, some sort of a message. And we talked about how we can handle this in a Laravel application with Blade template, but using Vue.js and Inertia, it needs a little bit more setup, which is actually quite easy. So first, let's go to our auth controller and after we register a user and redirecting him to the dashboard, we want to use the with method to add a session message. And I'm going to call it greet. And for the value, I'm just going to say welcome to Laravel Inertia View app. And I want to see this message when we go to the dashboard. Let's go to our dashboard view component and see how we can grab this. Now, normally in a blade template, we would just use the session function and we would grab it, but we cannot do this in a view component. Now, Inertia, again makes this kind of easy for us so if we go to the shared data documentation and scroll down we have a flash messages section and all we have to do is to expose session messages to our components using this share function which is inside the handle inertia requests we already did this with our authenticated user so let's go to handle inertia requests middleware and we just want to add another element to this array and the one that we want to add is this one so i'm just going to copy it and paste it down here so we are creating a flash object Within that, we have a message and the value of that message is gonna come from our session. Now, in this case, they are using the same name, so they are calling it message, but we could call it whatever we want. So in our auth controller, we are saying that go to the dashboard with this greet key. So that is the key we want to use. So therefore, we need to pass greet here. But when we grab it in our view component, we can use flash then message, or we can change this one as well. So let's call it greet. Now, before Adding this to the dashboard, let's go back to our website, go to view DevTools and select inertia component. Under props, we have a flash object and within that we have greet, which is set to null at the moment. So now we can go back to our dashboard and I'm just going to add a P tag here. Just say page props flash and then greet. And to make it kind of easy to see, I'm just gonna add some classes, padding four and some light green background. All right, so let's actually register. So I'm going to choose an image and I'm just gonna add some data, which later on I will delete them all. So register, we are redirected to the dashboard and we see the flash message. Now I think it's better to use a generic name like message as they did in the documentation. So we can use this in multiple places. So for example, if you wanted to show a flash message anywhere in your application, you would just use that same name, which would override the previous one and you don't have to create multiple ones. But that's all about flash messages. It was quite easy and quick and we just had to share that using the handle inertia request middleware. So thank you all for your support. See you at the next one.